I have come here to chew bubblegum and kick ass. And I'm all out of bubblegum. This is my boomstick. Shop smart. Shop S-smart. Hail to the king, baby. Groovy. Base. The final frontier. These are the voyages of the Starship Enterprise. Its five year mission to explore strange new worlds, to seek out new life and new civilizations, to boldly go where no one has gone before. Grumpy Old Nord's stream on Twitch. I just have one thing to say. Nord looked at my Playboy pics, and yes, he liked them. Now go save the galaxy. Warning. The following stream is intended for mature audiences only and may not be suitable for children under 17. Viewer discretion is advised. Oh, either the chatbot isn't working, or that's a hell of a delay. Hold on a second, why isn't that working? Okay, why didn't that work? DOS is weird. Oh, okay, that's weird. It got turned off. <laughs>
I don't know how or why, but it got turned off. It is now turned back on. <laughs> that was weird. Uh, okay, let's get some music going. Turn my mic up. Is it really quiet? Same it was before. Right. Turns the old microphone up. There you go. Hello! Oh, music. Music. Music! There we go. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the Meat Hall. I am the Grumpy Old Nord. Ah, it's the same volume it was set at before. I don't know why it's very quiet. Which is weird, because there is no in-game music. Wait, are you hearing music? Let me rephrase. Were you hearing music before I turned music on? Because you said turn the mic up before I turned the music on. I wonder if something didn't get fuggered up. I said fuggered up, and the captions knew what I meant. <laughs> also, hopefully we don't have any uh, stream latency issues, because I, I, uh, I adjusted my bitrate, so hopefully that won't be an issue anymore. I had never, I thought I had, but apparently I had never adjusted the bitrate to what YouTube recommends, and I was still using the, uh, the bitrate for, uh, Twitch, because apparently they're two different bitrates. Anywho, alright, so now that the stream is live and is working, yay, uh, let's see. If I hear one fucking heckle, I will staple your tongue to your taint so you can watch me kick your ass. <laughs> yeah, for some reason, sound commands got turned off. I don't know how or why. I just had to flip the switch to turn them back on. Hey, what's up, Dwayne? 18 seconds. That's that's a bit of a delay. That's a bit of a delay. I, I think I know what happened, and I'm going to... Hopefully, it will be fixed next stream. I, uh... When I was adjusting the bitrate, I also changed the quality of the stream uh, as far as the encoding goes. And apparently that, that increases the latency. So I, I changed it. Actually, I'm going to try something. Hold on. Because apparently I can do it while I'm live. I'm going to see if I can fix it here now. Let's try fastest. Oh. And... Okay. Let's see if that will change the... Uh, I mean, it probably won't have, like, an immediate noticeable effect. I missed a onesie party yesterday. Aww. What was I doing yesterday? Oh, I know what I was doing yesterday. I was, I was stressing the fuck out. So I was going to stream yesterday. I had OBS and everything set up, was ready to go. And uh, I, I was closing out of everything that I didn't need running while I'm streaming. Because normally I have like a couple of web browsers open, one on each screen for different things. And I went to go close one, and all of a sudden my computer B BSOD'd. I was like, uh, what? And I had to go through, uh, yeah, I had to go through a whole fucking thing last night. So that was fun. But yeah, I was going to stream last night until uh, my computer decided to flip me the bird. But I got it working again. Yay. So, uh, yeah, that was my yesterday. Uh, let's see. What else? I'm on my last pack of smokes, and I'm probably going to run out before the end of stream. So don't be surprised if I end stream stressed and irritated. <laughs> uh, let's see. What else? Uh, I've got a power bill coming up in a couple of days, so if anybody can, hit up one of those uh, donation links down below. That'd be fucking awesome. And I can't think of anything else. The usual depression kicking my ass as usual. I really got to figure something out for that, because I'm getting fucking tired of it. 
Uh, oh, I uh, I do have, I mean, it's not really relevant to the mead hall because this is something I want to do outside of the mead hall. Uh, but since I've been talking in the mead hall for a while about wanting to do a Valenhale game and nobody's really shown interest, I decided to take it out of the mead hall. I, I went to Reddit and I went to Roll20 and I posted a game looking for players thing. And uh, I started a new Discord server for that, and it, it, it's very possible I'm going to be running a Valenhale game in the near future. Uh, don't really have any details yet. And like I said, it's something that, as I'm thinking about it, it's something I want to do independent of the Mead Hall. Um, it's something I kind of want to do with, with strangers, with people I don't know. Uh and as, as I was thinking about this, there was there was a phrase that kept coming to my head. Familiarity breeds contempt. And in my attempts at running games over the last couple years, I have kind of come to the realization that the people that know me very well don't actually seem to like the way that I run games. Uh, Vampire, <laughs> Reliant, uh, a couple other things. Uh, and so I'm, I'm thinking maybe I'm going to try running a game for people that don't know me and, and see if that holds true or not. Uh, Valenhale is the, uh, the setting that, that I've been working on for, let's see, when did I first come up with it? Like 2004, 2005? I want to say 2004. So for a while now, about 20 years, I've been, I've been poking and prodding at this setting. And uh, I've never actually gotten to run a game with it. <clears throat> so it's something that I'm, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm looking at right now. And uh, I've got a couple people who have expressed interest. So I'm going to see where that goes, see how it goes. And uh, yeah, hopefully, hopefully that goes well. And I can finally get this Valenhale bug out of my system and, and, and actually do something with it. Oh, you shush. I just took you out. All right, other than that, I don't really have any other news. So, let's get to the game. Yay. And we've got an event going on, event campaign. I have not missed any days of this event yet, thankfully. I, I would like to not miss any days of this event. All right, let's go ahead and get my event daily done. Azure Nebula Rescue. Um, I'm in my, my current favorite ship. The USS Aqualonian. You're two thirds done with the campaign already. Nice. Very nice. The Tholians have captured a number of Romulan Republic ships and we need to free them. The ships are being held by tracks. Yep. Uh, ooh, I haven't seen one of those in the wild in a while. The uh, Orion Blackguard. Our time here is limited. Stay focused, plan your attacks, and save as many ships as possible. Every loss is critical for my people. Let's go over this away. One thing I've noticed in doing this with randoms is a lot of people don't really know the uh, the ideal way to do this. Burn! Oh, there was one more. Okay, now we can take it out. Hey, what's up, Stu? I'm not going to do the whole big thing. <laughs> How's it going, Stu? You've been AFKing it solo? I mean, yeah, that's one way to do it. Oh, there's somebody else up. A uh, Hapax hey, Warbird is escaping. Yay. Go zoom off, and I'm just gonna park my butt here. The 
Guardians are using their energy webs to trap your ships. Target and fire at the nodes connecting the webs. Uh, that's reverse. If you are caught inside the web, try to destroy one side of it and escape Here's a question. before it collapses in on you. Since starships, Federation starships are technically government, uh, government owned. Do they have the uh, the reverse indicator sound? Because that would be funny if they did. <laughs> that would be funny if they did. Nice, Savi. Redistribute shields. Why, I don't know. Because they're practically useless in this game. Let's get a grab well on this. As uh, that mesh weaver. Oh, okay. What the hell? I, I am noticing that gravwells like to get ignored a lot. It's rather quite frustrating. Especially on an EPG build where I have a really high control rating and I watch things just willy-nilly completely ignore my gravwell. Like, really? Come on. Although I think what's even more frustrating is when, you're, uh, when your gravwell bugs out. And it just doesn't spawn. More Tholian ships are on the way here. NPCs have a lot of stuff that'll just ignore control effects. That's lame. Lame. But yeah, I think the biggest annoyance is when your when your grab well just bugs out and doesn't actually spawn. Like it counts. Like it goes on cooldown, but there's no grab well. <laughs> between getting the miracle worker flight deck carrier the world razor uh those are both really good ships those are both really good ships okie dokie sabi enjoy your pizza It is a pretty ship in this lighting, is it not? That doesn't happen a lot, but every once in a while. It is very frustrating when it does. But it's it's been a long-standing thing. It's not anything new. That could be what causes it. That could actually be exactly what causes it. Yeah, I've, I've gotten better at trying not to be hitting my spam bar when I'm manually activating things. Because I have noticed that happens with stuff like uh, like the DPRM and stuff like that. I've noticed that. So I'm wondering if... Hmm... For the two tier six coupons, Lexington is a very good ship. I think Stu will absolutely back that up. And the Narendra, that is that is a must-have tanking trait. Yep. Server can only activate so many powers at once. This is yep. Oh, you know what? That begs the question. You shush. I just took you out. You shook the whining. She loves to whine the second I get on mic. Inevitably, without fail. So I just realized something. The way I have my spam bar set up might be an issue. So the way I have my spam bar set up is it's activating both of these rows at once. A Falchion Dreadnought is escaping. Hey, what's up, Rashad? How you doing? I'm wondering if I'm not getting more misfires than I realize because of that. 
I might need to uh, change that. Because my 10 and 9, so 10 will fire off before the 9. But then 8. Yeah, see how it's struggling to go through a ball? I might have to change that. I might have to change that. A Talis Warbird is escaping. Because I'm wondering if I'm not getting more misfires than I realize. <clears throat> yeah, that's Atelis normally what I do. Is, is I just spam the hell out of my space bar. <laughs> I am the worst player you know. <laughs> You'd have them in a line A one through zero, B one through zero. See, I, I've got it set up so that if I've got them on the this row right here, then it does that. But then these two get triggered at the same time. Hmm. We'll do some experimenting with that tonight and see if my, my theory that I just got is accurate. Because I suspect it might be. And I could be, uh, I could be nerfing myself with how I have my... I've had my shit set up this way for a long time, too. How long? It's been a few years, I think, I've had it set up like this. Oh, there were bad guys. Not anymore. <laughs> Escaping. Yeah, I now that I'm thinking about it, I definitely have a habit of just hitting buttons over and over again until I get the result that I want. Hmm. A Talis Warbird is a escaping. Falcon Dreadnought is escaping. Gotcha. Let's try. Let's move these down here. A Hapax Warbird is escaping. Let's see how it goes now that I've done that. Somebody died. They were in a big ship, too. Let's see how it goes now. All right, give me more things to shoot out. I need to test something. Come on. Give me something to shoot. Have a grab well and yeah. I suspect that may actually be a better way of doing it. Eh, yeah, Grom can be fun. I haven't hung out on his stream in a while. Of course. I'm not on Twitch anymore, anyway. Bastards. A 
Give me stuff. Give me loot. Give me all the loot. Give me the loot. Give me the prize. Oh. I'm I'm wary about this upcoming new Highlander movie with Henry Cable. I am not a fan of remakes. I'm generally not a fan of remakes. Every once in a while there's a good one. I am quite impressed with your fleet. And I do like Henry Cavill. I suspect he'll do it justice. It's in the works, it's in development. There's not a lot of news about it yet, other than that Henry Cable, Cavill, however his name is pronounced, is uh, attached as uh, supposedly playing Connor McCloud. But there's been a lot of rumors that it's not going to be an actual remake, but a reboot. And they're going to, the first movie is going to draw from the comics. But it's all speculation. There's not really a whole lot of official information yet. I did watch the trailer for the new Crow remake. I'm not impressed. <laughs> but we'll see. All right, let's check this. Yay! Ten more days! Oh, should I deal with my inventory? I suppose I should deal with my inventory. I, I went and made a bunch of isomags to sell on the exchange, only to find out they're all fucking dirt cheap now. So I'm a little, I'm a little miffed. Callie, shush. I know what you want. Well, a few days ago. Uh, I like a lot of the names that are attached to it. Oh, you're talking about the isomags. Oh, yeah. Because I hadn't really messed with them. But yeah, I guess it makes sense that uh, the market crashed. Oh, I am looking in the wrong place. I mean, it is logical. But I mean, the last time I did isomags, yeah, they weren't going that cheap. Like, even a shitty one was going for, like, a million. That's a little more. I might... I don't know. Is it even... Yeah, but how much dilithium does that take? I don't think it's worth the dilithium. could salvage them or just sell them for EC uh, maybe not this sucks because I wasted a, a bunch of uh, catalysts the uh, where's it at uh, where are they at Yeah, these things. I wasted... I mean, I've got a bunch of them, so I'm not that worried about them. Yeah, I don't think it's worth the uh, the dilithium to do that. In my opinion. I could burn through all of my refined dilithium and only get a few of them to an appropriate mod. That's a lot of fucking dilithium to burn through. Or I could just salvage them. Does it tell you how much salvage you'll get?
Not that I need salvage. I'm sitting at uh, three quarters of a million. And I don't do a whole lot of uh, re-engineering anymore. Oh, oh, I need to, uh, I'm tired of that always popping up. Where's that at? Where's that at? Is that it? There we go. Tired of that always popping up. Yeah, I'm just disappointed those things are, uh, eh. I remember the last time I went and made a bunch of isomags and I went to sell, sell them on the exchange. And I made millions of EC. Millions. Not so much anymore, though. Which is sad. Let's let's try something. Cause I don't think any of these are uh, a weapon type mod. Uh, weapon power, shield power, resist all, resist a quantum, plasma torp. Photon. Photon. Laser resist. That, I mean, it makes sense. Absolutely makes sense. Uh. How much dilithium am I going to waste? Now that one, where'd that go? So that's a weapon type, but it's probably not a very, uh... oh, I thought that was the resist. Oh, I thought it was, if, I thought it was, if it, if it was abbreviated, that was the resist. It had to actually be the full word for it to be the type, the damage boost. Well, shit. Oh, well. Yeah, I saw that, and I was like, ah, fuck, that's just the resist. Ah, uh, that would have been nice to know. Oh, well. I don't know. That's just frustrating. Hey, what's up, Jinx? How you doing? That's just frustrating. Oh. <laughs> okay. Well, there's AP. Yeah, okay. Let's re-engineer that. How much dilithium are we going to waste? <laughs> Turn. <laughs> uh, another torpedo type. Beams. I've got a few of those. Do those sell for anything good? Probably not. Yeah, I've got I've got a couple of the beams. And then I've got a cannons. I don't know if those are any good or not. Let's find out. Let's find out. 
Oh, those sell for more than the other ones do. I just don't want to sit here and waste through all my dilithium just to, you know what I mean? Oh, here, let's, uh... How much does this one go for? Almost a million, okay. Yeah, and there's just a ton of them on the exchange, too. Let's drive that price even lower, yeah? <laughs> One EC lower. <laughs> hey, look, it's a deal. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's St. Patrick's Day. I forgot about that. I didn't do my, uh, my usual St. Patrick's Day intro. Yeah, I'm not bothering upgrading them. I don't know. It just seems like it's a pain in the ass to do all this now. Make everything green. <laughs> I think I still have my uh, my old uh, St. Patrick's Day uniform. Or maybe not. I don't see it. Where's the tailor? Yeah. Let's replace uh, this one. Of course, it'll still be Carter. It won't be my new character. Would you calm down? You are fine. So we got that one. And then we got, I think this was the one I wound up going with. <laughs> Where's that at? Or then there's this. Uh Hello. Oh, you know what? Okay, never mind. I forgot. I I moved. I moved a bunch of stuff, and I haven't updated it all in my OBS yet. I, I don't remember where I moved that to. Why is my light suddenly flickering? Give me a second. My light is flickering. Just need to adjust it a bit. Uh, yeah, I, I went to uh, I went to a screen that I forgot technically isn't there anymore. Let's uh, okay, cancel. <laughs> Whole stream falls over. Yep. Let's see here. Let's see if I can find it. Where's that at? Uh. I can't just... No, apparently not. All right. You're not going to be very helpful, are you? Okay. No, why? Okay. You're, God damn it. Would you? Thank you. Nope. You. Hold on a second. We are experiencing technical difficulties. Okay. Let's go see if we can find it. Because it should be on this drive, but in the same place. 
There we go. St. Patty's Day video that I made a long time ago. Alright, what was I doing? Uh... Okay. So, we're gonna do it this way. Load outfit. Where is... Go with that one. And just the outfit. Where's that going to be at? Where's it at? Oh, there. there we go. Does it work? Well, it almost worked. We got the uniform. We did not get the hat. So let's get the hat. Uh, let's see. Hat. Helmets and hats. Top hat. There we go. No, we want to match rest. No. This is the closest. I hate how everything has a different fucking uh, color palette. Makes it very annoying. Oh. Uh, let's see here. Uh, not quite. No. Right about there? And then, let's see here. Want the great big bushy beard. Epic. There we go. Let's see here. Right about there. There. Yeah, yeah. Let's see here. Hair. Hairstyle. None. Uh, we'll go ponytail. Uh, if you're going to do it, you got to go all out. Got to go all out. So what's this one? C16 or C16? Eh, it's a little too dull. What's this one? C6. Let's try that. There we go. Aha! If we really wanted to have some fun with it, let's save this. And then, uh... Let's go... Torso length. 
<laughs> uh, let's see, arm length, leg length, and then height. Hey, JB, what's going on, buddy? Rename that. The Leprechaun. There we go. <laughs> oh, I, I forgot to put it on. I didn't put it on. There we go. <laughs> there we go. There you go, JB. That sounds fun. <laughs> Wee. Sadly, because he's human, I can't make him any shorter. I made him as short as I could. That's a wall. That's still a wall. Okay, there we go. Hey, what's up, Dark Ghost? How you doing? <laughs> it's an annual tradition. I did a full circle. Nice. All right, what am I doing? Besides running around like an idiot. Easy there, Han Solo. Uh, what do I want to do? Oh, let's see here. Or was that one of you that DM'd me, or uh, was that a random? You just saw me running around like an idiot. Okay, I don't know if it's just me, but that that vanity shield on the Suliban cell ship. Or at least I... Or no, no, that's not the cell ship. That's the, um... That's the, uh... <laughs> the flight deck assault carrier. That's right. And like, for a brief second, I was like, Oh, hey, it's the Millennium Falcon. <laughs> Just for, like, a brief second, if you squint at it right, is kind of what it reminded me of. The Aluminum Falcon, there we go. <laughs> you see it, though, right? Uh, it's not just me. Like, it's kind of got that vibe a little bit with that vanity shield on it. <laughs> All right, what am I doing? Uh, I guess I could go chase some Endeavors. I haven't, I haven't been chasing Endeavors for a while. Uh, complete a random TFO, destroy Borg ships, then Kethy ground and gain salvage. There's a reason I actually named my Silic the Aluminum Falcon. Oh, okay. Let's see. And Kethy ground. Welcome back, Savi. Where can I go for Zinkethi Ground? This is this is where the uh, 
This is where the uh, boundary would be nice and useful. Uh, let's see here. I have bookmarks that might be able to help. Let me go see if I can find it. Game. Star Trek. Uh, let's see here. Where is... And I bookmark guide for... Where's it at? Where is it at? Okay, it should be before all this. Where the hell is the bookmark for... Uh... Hmm. I could have sworn I had this bookmarked. Oh. Uh, let's see here. Okay. This isn't where I got it from, but is this website uh where is where's the guide for endeavors Okay, I do have a bookmarked. I just didn't find it. Let's see here. Ground. Then Kathy of Science, Importance, or Brush Fire. <laughs> I like space turtles. Yeah, I need ground, not space. All right. Let's see here. Uh, so... Probably going to be in Gamma Quadrant. Or not. New Frontiers. The Lucari have discovered. Yep. Let's go. I need to go kill a bunch of space turtles. Yeah, but I don't feel like trying to queue up for that. That one's a pain in the ass if you don't have it properly organized. Because don't you need, like, 20 people? Do you... The Lakari are just ahead. And eager to begin the search. Alright, let's go. It's good to see you again. Proto matter is the weapon of a coward, but we respect its power. Proto matter can also be quite. Oh, it's ten people. I thought it was twenty. Which one requires twenty, or do they not have any more like that anymore? Oh, that's what I'm thinking of. The colony sim. Okay. The probe is away. Perhaps the probe's information will give us more insight as to why these attacks are occurring. That's what I was thinking of. For the if so, it was a poor choice. Why scour a world already devoid of life? Oh God, I think I vaguely remember that. Like this. Hmm. Vaguely remember that. That was a long time ago. But one quite different from the first. What is the pattern? This makes no sense. There is no tactical pattern to these attacks. 
There must be a reason, though. Let's figure this out quickly before more lives are lost. This sucks there's no uh, ground battle zone for Zinkepi. Scanning. I'm detecting it. I can bet. I suppose you have. Let's go. It's been a large... Dan debris. Our scans are unclear. Let's go save some people. Do that Around Starfleet 50. thing. All that is left. A perhaps the I'm receiving a distress call. Uh, it's very uh, faint. I'm sending you the no. coordinates. Uh, there might be survival. All right, let's go save some people. I'm going the wrong way. Because, of course, I'm going the wrong way. Thank you. Go people over this away. Gally. I I thought no one would come. Thank you, strangers. Thank you. Rescued aliens. Someone heard. By all the gods, someone heard the signal. I'm saved. Ready back on your ship. Thank you again. I've confirmed. It is time. Yeah, that was a long time ago, that Salt Vampire TFO. Whatever the thing. Let's approach the planet. Zinkepi warship. Red alert! Yep, we're about to uh, give them a very bad day. Fight well and do not fear death. If we must fight, we will fight to win, General. I. That's a good question. I don't know if it does or not. I haven't heard that one mentioned in a while. I remember that one. That used to be really popular for some something specific, and I don't remember why. Did quite well in the first battle. A good battle, well fought. The honor of victory is ours. I remember what Big Dig was popular for. Like there was a specific reason we would do it a lot back in the day, and I can't remember what it was. It was just like the Defera ground invasion zone used to be popular to get the uh, Elite Omega Marks if you didn't want to do the, the Elite or Advanced TFOs. Now 
now I don't think anybody does the uh, the ground invasion zone other than for uh, um, their web you know like Borg t uh, Borg endeavors the Kaon particle traces lead into the valley ahead of us oh I see they followed oh. the waterfall oh 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 yeah we're, we're about to fall down the waterfall if we don't get on the road Rocks here are causing a lot of interference. We should take another set of scans to get our bearings. All right, there, Thumper. He didn't speak too soon. <laughs> They're big and angry. We now walk the path of violence. So be attack. Gally, what are you doing? Come, Zinkevi. See our two warrior fight. You will not stop us! Turtle soup is back on the menu, boys! <laughs> Zinkethi with a taste for battle. Good. Scans indicate they took the path to the east. Why would they destroy entire planets? They must find some tactical advantage in these actions for some reason. I'm reading Zenkethi life signs ahead. Good. They are waiting for us. Even ah, better. Good. We will meet them in glorious battle. Yeah, that had to have been a long time ago, Sov, because it was there when I first started playing. When I first started playing at the tail end of the, uh, when they did the, uh, temporal stuff. Oh, that was weird. Hey, I got my Endeavor. They're using delaying tactics. We must be getting close. The path continues down from here. The Protonator bomb is still ahead of us. Get them all. I leave. I got them. Go get some more. The Kaon levels are rising. We're getting closer to the Protonator bomb. I'm going to get out of that a little cone. Let's hit him with the big button. Get over here. Ha! They fight like cornered rabbit tars. I can smell their fear. There, just ahead. I see guards. We must be close. The timing on that is, is just great. There, up ahead, I see guards as I'm killing them. Oh god, this part. The trail ends. I'm reading a move swiftly, and we can take them by surprise.
And I got what I came for. Don't really need to do the whole mission. So I'm not seeing the thing I'm supposed to do. Been a while since I've done this mission. Yeah, I got what I came for. I don't need to do the whole mission. Alright, next endeavor. Uh, Borg ships. That'll be relatively easy. Go do a... Uh, marks. There is infected. And I'm going to set it to advance. Actually, you know what I could do? Hold on. Hold on a second. Where is... We'll just do it this way. We'll just do it this way. The situation is there's more. I'm just solo and ISN. Infected space normal. I literally just need five Borg ships. Five Borg ships, and I'm going to get them in that first fucking wave, too. Scanning the nanite transfer. We are all guns. Additional big guns available. Prepare for I'll just do it this way. Besides, I get more dilithium doing it this way. Lots of loot. And more loot. Is that cube moving? Grab the loot. Take this out before I take out the gateway. <laughs>
The Borg did not come prepared. <laughs> From this time forward, your culture will adapt to service ours. Sensors confirm that the trans... Sensors confirm you can shut the fuck up. <laughs> now I wonder how many times I would have died if I had done that on Elite. Alright, uh, gain salvage. Oh, I gotta figure out what the fuck to do with all these damn isomags. Let's see here. We can salvage that. What else can we salvage? We can salvage that. Why do I have a feeling I am not going to get enough salvage from this? I've just got a funny feeling. I'm going to go through all the loot that I picked up in there. And it won't be enough. My endeavor. Just got a funny feeling. And I was right. Looking in the wrong place. I just need a little bit more, though. Not a lot more, just a little bit more. Let's do, uh, oh, what? Yeah. Uh, where is this one? No. There we go. Rescue and search. That one. 500k disruptor damage, space, and kill 10 Tholian ships. Uh, Tholian ships. Good to see you, my friend. The Can't Archer you System Patrol. Is a good place to go for Tholian ships. Really, that was all I got. Hopefully, there will be more at the end. Let's go! I do love this ship. Might not be the objectively best ship in the game, but I love it, and it is very good. Oh yeah, Stormbound. Yep. That'd be another good one. Thank you for coming to the blessing. God, that's bright. I, if you let's close that up, that's one less rip to worry about. Let's regroup with Kumarke. Bad news, I'm afraid. Klingons are approaching our position. Blank. Target shield has 
all that beautiful crit flank. Some damage. Pop another grab well. See, they're paying attention to the grab well. And I died. Shit. <laughs> Oopsie doodle. Oopsie doodle. Let's pull everybody back in. Let's get some assistance. Herc, do your thing. Oh, God damn. Okie dokie. That hit hard. on that grab well. Uh, they might be too far away from the grab well. Yeah. Control is not that high on this build. Now I should have, well, here in a minute. Not now. I got to pick up my space litter. I got to collect all the loot. It would be completely irresponsible of me to leave all this uh, space litter lying around. We got one more up here, and then I'll be good. All right. Salvage. Hopefully. When have I ever worried about... Hey, space litter is no laughing matter. It should always be taken serious. There we go. 
I gots my endeavor. Might as well go ahead and open up all these boxes. Yay. Ooh. And I'll take some Omega Marks. That'll go in my account bank. All right. I think that was the last of them. Indeed. Indeed. Now I just got to get my Universal, which will be really easy. All right, let's head to DS9. Is there we go. No sleep till the Alpha Quadrant. So I think I'm already in the Alpha Quadrant, but whatever. Here, my inventory out some. Kamikaze right into the promenade. <laughs> Sir, we're approaching uh, Deep Space Nine. Excellent ramming speed. <laughs> what? <laughs> so, the stuff. I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do with all those damn isomags. <sighs> this is disappointing. I am very disappointed that those do not sell on the exchange like they used to. Like, like I said, I get it. I understand why they don't. But I'm still disappointed. That door did not want to open. Let's see here. Uh, right, these go in the banky bank, and then that in the account bank. All right, I'm gonna take a quick bio break. I will be back in a few minutes. Take the dog out. All that. I will see y'all on the other side.
Warning, the following stream is intended for mature audiences only and may not be suitable for children under 17. Viewer discretion is advised. Apparently, I have not re-enabled that command yet. We is order back. When was that one? Let's see here. Oh, sound commands. Where are you? I'm assuming it was this one. If I had a dick, this is where I'd tell you to suck it. There we go. It has been re-added. There you go, Sabi. One of these days, I need to take the time to, to, to finish re-adding everything to the, uh, the chat bot. Uh, we re-added that one? We have not re-added that one. Maybe I should just make that the rest of the stream as re-adding everything to the chat bot. <laughs> uh, there it is. No shit, Sherlock! This is true, Savi, this is true. This is very true. Ooh. We've got a perk point. It's all ground. I'm going to go crit chance ground. Yay. Yeah, it's definitely one of those things that I need to do. I just haven't gotten around to doing it yet. There's some other staples that haven't been added yet. Let's see. That's been added. That's been added. Oh, that one was already added. It was just, it wasn't Sherlock. It was no shit. So fucking what? No shit, Sherlock. <laughs> yep, that one's already been added. Oh, you know what I haven't added? Where's that one at? I don't know how many people will remember this one, though. Where's it at? <laughs> that one should probably have a cooldown. Uh, what else? Oh, what was the, uh... What was the, uh, derp derp Was it this one? Rawr. That means I love you in dinosaur. Okay, so that one's that one. Where's the other one? What was the other one? Uh, let's see here. No, not that one. Where's the, uh... 
this one? What's this? What's the difference between these two? Rawr. That means no. I love. Not that one. God damn it! Why doesn't it ever remember? Uh, what was the uh? What did I name the other one? I don't remember what I named the other one. Roar. That means I love you in dinosaur. This one? There we go. That means I love you in dinosaur. Actually, no, this one should be... Okay, I see. And then go to There we go. There we go. We'll, we'll get this right. We will get this right. There. There we go. Okay. Uh, let's see. I still need to do some random TFOs. I'm just going to queue for random and see what pops up. That popped quick. All right. Let's see what we get. Krang. I don't remember what the, uh... <clears throat> you don't have a lot of time, so... Uh-oh. Which one is this gonna be? What are we gonna get? This is the one that has a bunch of possibilities. My, my mail flashed. Why did my mail flash? Oh, somebody bought my... Uh, okay, cool. Somebody bought my isomag! Yay! <laughs> JB. Ships detected. They're on an intercept course. He got Zen Cappy. No grab wells here. I took some damage there. Hearts are ready below seventy five percent. Yeah, a lot of people don't know or just don't care. There's, there's some other ones over there you could get. Oh, never mind.
Alright. Uh, this is a pretty space map, isn't it? We shall position ourselves. Hopefully, I'll be able to get uh, multiple enemy signals both sides. Get ready. Pop that DPRM, damn. And I'm dead. Dumb bitch. <laughs> oh, this is gonna go great. I can already tell. This is gonna go fantastic, Lee's. Die again. Holy hell. This is gonna be fun. much you want to bet there's people parked on beta doing nothing. God damn it. <clears throat> I had that happen a few times during the uh, Pavo event. Where I'd go in and there'd be like two people just parked on beta during the first wave. Apparently, yeah. I did not realize I was that squishy in this ship. That or it's just a fucking Zinkethi or a pain in the ass. I used it. <laughs> it was on cooldown. remember if I've got isomags on this or not. I don't think I updated this build. Or maybe I did. I'd have to look.
Well, this is not a fire at will build. This is a beam overload build. I am running isomags. Holy Jesus. Okie dokie. Satellite upgrades are now of good times. I just know I went with the, uh, the, the, the Maelstrom because it does more damage. If you're gonna do a stupid fucking useless fucking... Get the fuck off of territory you ain't gonna park and defend, piece of shit! Fuck you! At least you're not an engineer. Fucking worthless, though. God damn, I hate when people do that. up the enemy flagships. Hang on up there. I don't think anybody's on beta. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, this is... This is doomed to failure. Good times. Now, they don't do a lot of damage, but... God damn it. But do I really want all the fucking Zenkethi fucking tractor beamed in one spot? No, not particularly. I'd, I'd rather have the fucking phaser satellites than the tractor beam satellites, but I'd rather have the tractor beam satellites than the fucking uh, shield satellites. Shield generator alpha is at 75%. Oh my. Oh. It turned around. Okay. Yeah, I think we're going to fail because nobody is on beta. Shield generator gamma is at 75%. Shield failing. Less shield
Yeah. Usually it's not an issue. I don't know what the fucking issue is today. I, I'm just going to assume it's because it's in Kepi. Shield generator alpha is at 50 percent. Because, like, during the Pavo event, I was constantly soloing. Shield generator beta has been destroyed. Yeah. Shield generator gamma is at 25 We failed. Oh, God damn it. You did what you could. Now, it's up to us. We'll get the defenses online and prepare for a ground assault. Ship is under attack. We failed. Oh, that's true. Yeah, I forgot about that. Normal versus elite. This is true. I didn't think of that. That was frustrating. That was mildly frustrating. Uh, let's see here. Let me save my loadout. Let's switch to my tank. Although, I don't know if my tank would have helped me there. <laughs> I really don't. My tank build probably needs some updating. I put this together a long time ago. Let's see, what do I normally run for my tank? It's, uh, uh, let's see here. What do I normally run for my tank? Strategist, obviously. The primary I normally run is it Miracle Worker. I feel like it's Miracle Worker that I run. My primary. Yeah, but I don't really have a build like that, Stu. Let's see. You did, it was frustrating. Oh, and because we failed, it didn't count for the endeavor. Good times. All right, let's try again. This time I shall do it in my tank. I mean, my tank does do some damage. I mean, it's not going to break a million DPS, but... Oh, elites don't count toward the universal? Ah. <sighs> Of course they don't. Decline. Because of course they don't. I did not know that. I figured it didn't count because we failed. <laughs> I 
Yeah, I was gonna say, like, I'm pretty sure this tank has done like three, four hundred K DPS. But that was a while ago. I don't think I parsed with my tank and Oh no. Because I did uh I tanked for somebody's ISE run not too terribly long ago, maybe a month or two. I don't remember when that was. We'll see. Yeah, I didn't realize elites didn't count for the endeavor. That's kind of dumb. Use the task force operations menu to queue up for a random TFO. Doesn't say anything about what difficulty it's got to be. Stu, I just noticed you're surrounded by odysseys, but you're not in one. <laughs> oh god damn it. Glad you could make it. We're picking up an incoming fleet on sensors. <sighs> They'll be here in moments. Well, welcome to Day is a day of testing it would <laughs> Testing my patience. Somebody's actually flying a Jupiter. Wow. That's something you don't see very often. That is something you do not see very often. Vessels at the near the shipyard is west of our location. Hurry! The enemy is closing in. Where the fuck even is the uh Oh that's right, it didn't show up till after this. Evacuation force at the shipyard. Need your help. Unknown vessel on sensors. There what it is. That is. Thing? This? This? All right. Is your all right what I'll do federation? is I'll just follow the yeah, damn. Can I skip, of course? Engineering crews to your posts. I've got a plan. This is Lieutenant Commander Scott at the shipyard. All right, where's it at? There it is. I'll just follow this bad boy. Get all the threat. Ships on sensors. We could use some help back here. And that way, when they... Oh, my God. Is nobody going to be doing the thing? Please tell me somebody's doing the thing.
Alright, fine. Alright. Since it appears that no one is doing what you're actually supposed to do in this TFO, I'll let everybody else tank for me! And then I fucked up. Because of course I did. Oh, god damn it. No, 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 no. Move, move. Come on, get in front of it. God damn it. The hell? Oh, okay. Ah. Uh. That, that seems to be the, uh... Shit, move, move. Dead. Good times. <sighs> God damn it. That should do it. Direct hit. That not but I did it. Stop doing that. All right. This time, pay attention to what's spewing out of its mouth before you jump in front of it. That would seem to be good. Oh God damn it! God damn it.
Thought I dropped the damn thing. Not exactly the best ship for me to be in to be the only fucking one doing this. That should do it. Direct hit. Ah, shit. Move your ass. Gonna take out that warp core. Fuck it. Fuck it. That should do it. Direct hit. Oh, no. Oh. I think somebody else got on it. Good. Probably too late, though. Get in front of you in here. Have a bite of that. Oh, God damn it. That should do it. Direct hit. I'm going to laugh my ass off if we fail. Shit, shit, shit. I did not. God damn it. <sighs> Good times. Good times. Can I drop the warp core? <laughs> This is fun. Totally my definition of fun. Excuse me, give me the goddamn warp core. Indeed, and I'm the one getting kicked down the goddamn hole. Come on, get in front of it. Have a bite of that. This is what I wanted to do. I wanted to just sit here on top of this thing and tank all the goddamn interceptors. Jesus Christ, what the fuck? Before it makes a meal out of us. All right, is someone stupid going to grab it or am I going to grab it? Shield it against the enemy weapons the best we can. They're the same thing. <laughs> Better make it count. It seems the Federation has a new weapon. Destroy it. It has priority over the star base. Uh. 
Are you serious? Give me, give me the thing. Thank you. Get right in front of it. Why are they doing... Come on. Nom nom nom. Oh shit. Hit it, hit it, hit it. You did it. Thank you fuck. got a doomsday machine. Unbelievable. Great job. You stopped the time. <sighs> Fuck's sake. Fuck all y'all. <laughs> Fuck. Hate that goddamn TFO, even with a good team. Like, when you got people who know what they're doing, I like gravity kills. That TFO, even with people you know who know what to do, still fucking sucks. What is it? What is it you like to call uh, counterpoint solve? Uh, taxi? Taxi simulator? No, that is taxi simulator. God damn it. But I got my endeavor. That is all that matters. Holy shit. Oh, I thought that's what you called it. What is it you call it? Or maybe it's somebody else calls it that and I thought it was you. Ah, uh, okay. I thought it was you that came up with that. What ship are you in, Stu? You are in the... Access denied. <laughs> uh, oh, oh, that's the, uh, the the Tier 6 Stargazer. Okay. Or the Constellation. I, st I don't think I ever finished setting mine up. As I know, I got one, but I don't think I ever finished setting it up. Uh, let's see. Where is it at? Was it this one? Yeah, this one. Yeah, that is, that is as far as I got into setting this up. <laughs> I did buy the pets for it, though. I gotta figure out what kind of build to put on this thing. I don't think I've ever put a command carrier together.
Fleet Power Network Array. I'm going to assume that this is one that we want to keep on it. Let's see here. Uh, yeah, we'll do some isomags. Don't I have more of those? Yeah. Uh, oh, I never... Okay, I've only got four of them. I thought I had five. I know there's one engineering console I'm going to want. Uh, where's that one at? What the hell is the name of that console? Um, where is it at? Where it be? Where it be? God damn it. Oh, there it is. I see it. Reinforced Armaments. That's the name. Uh, I guess we'll put the Lorcator there. Let's see here. What else do we got? There is. There it is. Get the DPRM on there. See, now I'm just building a frickin' beam overload build. I don't think that's the philosophy I should have for this. Domino. Ah, oh, where'd it go? Where'd it go? There it is. Domino. There. Let's see here. You. You. And you actually, what? no, 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 not that, that, pulse phaser omni. Idiom. Slap some deuterium on there. Excuse me. Yeah, there we go. And let's see here. 
I've got the space for it. I'll throw a whole patch on there. There's some energy amplifiers. And what am I missing? You know what I haven't used on a build in a long time? RMC. Oh, oh, apparently I was going for a torp build on this at some point. Maybe that's what I should do. Maybe I should make it a torp build. Which means I would be changing a whole lot of what I just did. Because <laughs> I assume if it's a command carrier, it's got access to... Uh, Command seating. Yeah. Hmm. That's interesting. I don't have, um... Okay. Well, I can fix that. R&D, officer training. Give me... And concentrate firepower. One of those. I have to watch some build videos for this. Honestly, other than just making it a... a that Miracle Worker seat kind of... You mean these? I'm going to have to get the thing I've already got on it? Okay, I'll, I'll be sure to do that. <laughs> Let's see, SRO side one. For that. For some reason she did not have that already. Give me that. More marks. Means more dilithium. Yay! Oh, this is very much a what the hell kind of thing. Terran Eagle is a very, very good torque boat. Very good ship. Like, I think uh, in Stu's, uh, one of Stu's recent videos where he talked about, uh, you know, best ships in the Zen store, I think he said it is arguably the best torque boat in the game right now. And I can confirm I have that ship, and it is a lot of fun. Okay, so I think that's what I'm going to do, is I'm going to make this a, uh... I'm going to make this a Torpster. Means... Chronic. Particle emission? No. Actually, I don't think it's the Neutronic that I want, either. Hmm. I 
can't remember what the uh Delphic 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 there. Chronic Delphic and Maelstrom. So yeah, so these come off. Since I'm not doing that. just realized hmm this is gonna be a hard one to build for me Well, I won't need this. Or these. Was it this one? I know those are good. Hmm. Interesting. Um. Yeah, this one. I'm definitely gonna have to watch uh, some build videos on this. This one's a bit different from the torque builds I normally put together. Where's the console I was just looking at? Over there. There it is. I feel like this one would be useful on this build. Tricks you out. Oh, that'd be a good one. Where's the one I was just, uh... One I was thinking of. There's the one. There it is. Then we'll get the two-piece with the DPRM. I don't need these. Uh, 
Oh, I'm definitely going to have to watch some build videos for this one, because I honestly don't know what to do with this. I honestly don't know what to do with this. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, Augie has one. I think Stu has one. Let's see here. Let's do that. Okay, there's Augies. And there's Stews. Hey. Shush, Stew. <laughs> well, I haven't even watched Stew's video on it yet. Okay. I'm gonna have to watch that later. Actually, what I'm going to do, get back, open that, and open that, because I'm going to watch them both. Not right now, though. Not right now. Okay, I think what I'm going to do, let's switch to, uh... Hmm. Oh, switch to the eagle. Let's see here. Maelstrom, Delphic, Tronic, Dark Matter, and then the Delphic Beam, because it's a 5-1. Get you that two-piece. I forget what the two-piece for this does. Though it's not as important as the torpedo. Is. Ah, it's crit chance and severity. Though. Okay. have a feeling I will wind up using a lot of these same consoles. Except I've only got one tactical slot on that ship. So... Yeah, at most you can only get three uh, vulnerability locators. And that's if you don't do the locator. That is such a weird ship lay uh, layout. Like, why did they give it so much science seating if it's not going to be a full science ship? I, I'm genuinely curious to know what they were thinking when they designed that ship. Oh, uh, let's see here. What do I normally do for, uh, for torque builds? Oh, apparently I normally do Intel. Okay. Apparently for this build, I did the same thing I do for, uh, my beam overload build. Interesting. I really wish your skill specs saved a loadout. That would be a nice quality of life feature. 
Oh, uh, I don't know. I was actually wondering if I shouldn't call it soon so I can actually watch those videos. I've been going for almost three hours. That's about what I normally go to. It's about three hours. I'll probably start stream early tomorrow because I've got a I got a power bill coming up very 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 soon that I would like to actually get the money for. what I want to do. I kind of want to put that build together which means I'm going to have to watch a bunch of videos and I don't want to do that on stream because that would be awkward I think I'll go ahead and call her there what do y'all think Ladies and gentlemen and everyone in between, thank you all very, very much for hanging out with me tonight. I hope you had fun. I tried to, but, um, well, <laughs> you saw what happened. <laughs> we'll be back tomorrow, probably earlier. Uh, I don't know exactly what time I'll start. I would, I would set up a raid target or give you a link for who to go watch next, but nobody I know is streaming STO right now, so I leave you to your own devices. But uh, I want to thank you all for hanging out. I hope you had a good time. Like I said, I'll be back tomorrow with some more STO shenanigans, and hopefully my Awani will be fully put together by then. Oh yeah. I hope you guys all have a good rest of your night. And uh, as I always say, live long and prosper. Peace and long life. And keep on rocking in the free world because you fucking deserve it and don't let anyone tell you otherwise. But until I see you again, I bid you all adieu. I hope you all have a good night. Yeah, now I'm just repeating myself. That's a good sign. It's time to call it. <laughs> you guys take care. And like I said, I'll be back tomorrow. Just not sure what time yet. But I salute you all. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.